What's up guys? Got a uh, our latest little van build here from Launch Vans. Tied together with uh, our dealership EM Motors. Um, super stoked how this one turned out. Um, it was for sale yesterday morning but a guy came and checked it out before we finished it and scooped it up and we did a couple extra things he wanted. Another lagoon table and a microwave but it's pretty much done, just a little dirty, but uh, wanted to make a quick video about it. It's a 2019 um, 144 high roof, four wheel drive, blue gray color. It's got uh, black rhino, um, ah, I always forget the name of the wheels, Yorks, sorry, black rhino York wheels, BF Goodrich uh, KO2 tires, they're 265, 70, 17 inch. Um, do really awesome. Uh, we got uh, a little Fiamma awning F80 uh, tied into uh, Flatline Van Company's uh, rack. Got 300 watts of solar up there. We got a max air fan, and uh, we didn't we didn't really cover up the. It says XM satellite or whatever it is, Sirius satellite radio antenna towards the front so but you could add more solar if wanted um, ended up doing the galley here in the doorway a little fold down table um, that retracts up kind of cool um, again we used to flatline van company's little step uh, really like that super easy like I said we ended up uh, adding this second lagoon table for uh, for this gentleman, uh, he wanted to be able to serve some drinks from it at some events and then uh, be able to kind of block, he ended up sending it down, but kind of block the entrance so they can't get in and out of the van. Um, or you can just pop it off. A uh, little outlet here, we have an induction cooktop that you can set on the countertop or outside here. Um, and then we have our sink, little Ravati sink there. Uh, and then we did the, the faucet here in this location so that you can uh, take a shower, rinse off outside here, the door. And then also you can hang it on the ceiling and have a shower inside in the winter. So uh, pretty cool. Um, the van's pretty loaded. It has uh, heated, uh, leather heated power memory seats uh, that swivel so the lower seat bases are super nice uh, we did the s bar diesel heater in the seat base there this one has the 10 inch uh, touch screen let's just get in here A little 10 inch touch screen action um, again sorry it's dirty it has the um, nicer display here it has the radar cruise control, which I, I like uh, to set, and it just keeps you a certain distance from the vehicle in front of you and brakes for you if you want. Um, what else? That's pretty much, I mean, it has, uh, I love this front storage here. You have uh, wireless charging if you want to set your phone in here, screen mirroring, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. Um, but uh, yeah, so super loaded from Mercedes. It's got all the safety package, blind spot, accident avoidance. Um, it'll pull you back in your lane. If you start swerving out of the lane on accident and don't pull it back over, you can shut all that off if, if you don't like that stuff. But uh, I got a little Shuck San, Shuck San uh, Vans uh, overhead shelf. We really like theirs. And then we got all the insulated curtains in up there. Added a light up here, which is pretty cool. Got the induction cooktop um, sitting in there right now. Uh, more, <laughs> more curtains. Those curtains take up a lot of room from the Overland Gear guy uh, stuffed with Havelock wool. Super thick, but keep the van uh, nice and toasty in the wintertime. Uh, but yeah, swivel seats. We got a lagoon table here um, that, you know, you can put it whatever which way. Um, so yeah, three or four people, super comfortable. You can even set a chair here, you know, play some cards, kind of hang out inside if the weather's 
crappy. Um, yeah, so super nice. Oh yeah, we did add another light in, in the cabinet here. Um, got the old uh, two-seater with shoulder belts that folds up out of the way. Super nice. You can still, with the seat down, you can still get in here and get a get a cold one in there, uh, which is nice. But yeah, with this thing folded down, it is super spacious in here. So, really like uh, how you're able to open the area up here. Same with the bed. We have it back one one notch. We didn't do flares on here, but uh, um, but yeah, you can set this bed, you know, like this, or stack it all in the back, and have even more room to kind of hang out. Customer, like I said, wanted a, a microwave, so we kind of mocked up something to make it work after the fact. Um, got a little mule bag, we like that. We can take that bracer out, so if they bang their head or something while they're in bed, and they can stuff that full of their clothes and has tons of pockets everywhere, so we kind of like that. That going on there. We got a max air fan, um, 10 speed with the remote. Um, really like those, so you can keep them open during travel and during rain and uh, keep ventilation coming in or out. It's a reversible uh, fan. Um, little control panel here. Got the color control Victron Energy. Uh, you can shut off the inverter uh, on and off there. Um, you got your uh, Victron Energy uh, BMV to monitor uh, everything coming through the van as well. S-Bar diesel heater. We got your water heater. We have an isotemp uh, or isotherm, sorry, uh, four gallon uh, uh, water heater that you can turn on here. Got the outlet. Um, uh, you can turn the outlet on on the side of the galley and then to turn the microwave on here and off of battery power. I love it. Be able to power up your battery, uh, or sorry, your microwave um, with battery power. Um, we have. Uh, we used uh, 200 amp hours of uh, Battleborn lithium, uh, and then we used all Victron Energy stuff, as you can see. We got the solar controller, 100 and 150 amp, the uh, Victron uh, Orion battery to battery smart charger, and then the big bad wolf there, the uh, uh, 3,000 watt uh, inverter charger, um, so you can pretty much run you know, all kinds of stuff uh, through the system. Powers a microwave, coffee maker, you know, whatever. Uh, most most everything you wanna you wanna run. We got a uh, little Revati sink here, um, and it's got a nice little strainer, which I kind of like. Pretty good size sink. Lagoon table again the second one we can get that out of the way and then you can set your your stove up here we'll sometimes just inlay the, the induction cooktop in here and make it permanent but decided not to on this one and the customer liked that um, let's see here what else we got here you got a little uh, <clears throat> little uh, you can check your you can't really see it in the video but you can check your uh, water level. I can see it going through there. There's a light inside the cabinet. And then you have your garage lights. It'll track everywhere. This and kind of just used a adventure wagon kit as the base. Um, so kind of like their kits. They work really well as a good base for your build if you want to. A lot quicker anyway for installs. Uh, we got uh, two C.R. Lawrence T-Vent windows on both sides here. So you get some good ventilation coming through the van. Uh, custom mattress, six inch, super comfy. We're also making some four inch um, in case someone doesn't want one that thick, but man, super comfy. Uh, let's see here, what else we got going on here? 
oh trucker fridge did i mention that already can't remember if i did trucker fridge 130 big fridge not the biggest freezer but still you can get some ice cream and some goodies in there um this one aluminum cabinets but uh yeah didn't really build anything in there kind of leave it up to the customer to get maybe some kind of bin that works best for them um so we have yeah in this in this tank we have the 20 i think it's 22 gallon over the wheel well water tank the isotherm uh four gallon slim um what else we got in there we got the rear shower hot water obviously is nice coming to the to both faucets but uh we got the water fill and we got the mixer valve and the shower this works really nice nice italian made take a shower wash the dogs off wash your gear off whatever you want there outlets 12 volt outlets there's your load lights up top super nice at night stuff bags rb components on the doors get your pillows in there or whatever maybe put your insulated curtains back here um l track for the bikes bed set to, to be able to accommodate up to an extra large uh, mountain bike frame you can get you know two to two to five bikes in there if you wanted to depending on how you position them um yeah super cool here let's take a little step back here got uh alvan's uh spare tire carrier love that super easy install shore power 30 amp plug luminous ladder so you can get up here clean off your solar panels or you can still put a little bit of a deck in here again don't want to cover up the satellite uh, antenna but you can you can have a little deck up there move the solar panels more forward you can even get a little deck going on back here but uh, yeah flatline van company we love their racks just super easy and kind of you can configure it in so many different ways depending on what you want to accomplish factory roof rails super nice <clears throat> really digging this blue gray color looks good oh got a uh, little van compass shout out to van compass love their we got their uh, Fox suspension tuned to the weight of the van and their leaf spring um, so handles a lot better raise the rear from you know they drop a couple inches after you you add the weight so tear wagon uh, hood spoiler we love their products sweet van super pumped on it customer loves it and uh can't remember if i pointed that out i think i did a little table retractable cable some uh tie downs hang some stuff room for your dirty shoes or mats and things like that but uh love it anyway uh, let me know what you guys think if you guys have any questions you also we always have tons of used vans and uh, new vans for sale uh, with partial builds or we can do a full build for you um, our website is emmotorsboise.com here in Boise Idaho and uh, yeah just loving the van life super nice all our customers are are the best super friendly you know like-minded we love it we love you guys so thanks for checking the video out let me know if you have any questions and uh yeah thanks for watching guys take care